I can't remember whether I actually talked about this in a video that I released or not. There's about 10 videos that I made about Trump that I never released. Um, but at least I got it out of my system, right? And one of those, um, that I'm not sure if I released it or not, <laughs> I sometimes lose track of the over 2,000 videos that I've <laughs> released, um, where I was, I was saying that it, I think Trump is eventually going to try to ban CNN and some other news sources from being at White House uh, press briefings. And I, I guess he's already, he's went there. He went there. He's now banned CNN and New York Times. And some have reported that he's uh, banned Associated Press and uh, Los Angeles one of those, the Times. I don't know if it's the Times. It's it's several that come out of Los Angeles, and it's one of them. Yeah, he's done this, and what I expect next is for him to uh, give Infowars White House uh, press credentials, and we might see you know Infowars being part of his hand-picked now. And that's going to be his... The only people he wants to, to cover him are the hand-picked ones. Yeah. Um, and we're supposed to have freedom of the press. And I, I understand that he doesn't like CNN or New York Times and thinks they're fake news, but this is unprecedented. This kind of move is unprecedented. And if you can somehow defend his actions in this, I don't know what to tell you. Um... Especially if you're someone who says that you believe in freedom of speech and you get all pissy if someone blocks you or bans you just from their own comment section here on YouTube. You get all pissy over that, but then you're going to give Trump a free pass on banning news organizations. It, anyway, um, yeah, this is not the way this is supposed to be. But uh, a lot of things about this presidency are not the way things are supposed to be. We can hope that checks and balances will continue to come into place that will continue to be used to stop Trump from doing some shitty things, but uh, yeah, this, this is not a good sign. Um, he is indeed treating his presidency like a dictatorship. Whether he'll actually be able to truly be a dictator um, is yet to be seen. Again, I hope the checks and balances will keep him from actually being that. But the amount of people who just blindly support him and blindly support anything that he does and gives excuses for everything that he does might make it difficult to stop him from, you know, making his presidency into a dictatorship. So...